On Saturday, Lakewood Health System in Staples hosted a mini duathlon for a simple but important cause. We know getting out, being um, physically active and having something to train for is going to help reduce the risk of chronic illness in the future and that's what we want to make our communities healthier. Times and place finishes were recorded, but that's not what this event was really about. This is not really a race, this is an event. Yeah. So you really race yourself. Mm -hmm. um, if anything, you're, we're really not racing each other. Anybody can walk or run a mile. Mm -hmm. Anybody can run or uh, ride a bike for six or seven miles. Let's hope that we can get more community members out. Participants in this year's event range from age eight to 61 years old. Old ladies rock! The race started with a 1.5 mile run, then onto the bike for eight miles, don't forget your helmet, and concludes with a 1.3 mile sprint. Pretty fun starting out, and then about halfway through the bike race, you don't think that you even want to finish. Ask anyone at the Lakewood Mini Duathlon, and they'll tell you that running is easily the hardest part of the race. Are you kidding me? Absolutely not. Biking is by far the toughest part of the race. Everyone knows that. Come on now. The toughest part for me was biking, and I don't have a very good bike, so maybe that was the problem. I think the hardest part is the second run because your legs are numb and tingly from the bike. Biking on the hills, I've never been good at hills. Running would be harder because I'm not very fast. No matter if you're fast or slow, young or old, what really matters is that you're staying active and doing it together as a community. It's just challenge yourself. Just get off the couch. Let's get moving and grooving. See what you can do. Reporting in Staples, Chaz Moots. Woo! Way to go! Yeah! Lakeland News. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.